Hello, 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 this is your mobile patron here. So today we're going to be showing you how to make a Minecraft Pixel Moon server for you and your non-existent friends. The first step here is you're going to want to go to Pixel Moon, the website, which is reforge.gg. This will bring you to this website in this big green download button. Normally these are fake, but this one's actually real. So you're going to click that, and it's going to download a file called Pixel Moon 1.12.2 8.1.2. And that's what you like, that's good, that's good stuff. So now you're going to come over to this website, files.minecraftforge.net, click on these three lines, Go to 1.12.2, and then you're gonna, it's going to bring you here, you can click Installer. It's going to bring you to a page like this, you can click, wait for this to count down, you're going to click Skip, and it should download this Forge file here, and that's these are the two files you're going to need. So the next step of this, you're going to right click on your desktop, go over to New, and make a new folder. This is going to be the folder for your server, so I'd recommend naming it like, something like Pixelmon Server, because that's what's going to be, a Pixelmon Server. Nice, good job, that's how naming things works. Anyway. The next step is you're going to want to open up this file here, the Forge Installer. What this is going to bring do is going to bring up this menu, and it might leave one of these little things here, you can just delete that, you don't really need it, but yeah, fuck you. Anyway, so, what you're going to want to do, you're going to want to make sure you click Install Server. And what this is going to do is actually going to install a server into your folder. So you're going to go to your folder, and you're going to go to Desktop, and Pixel 1 Server, and click Open. And you're going to want to make sure it says Pixel 1 Server, it should say Desktop before, if it's on your desktop. And you're going to click OK. This is going to take a few seconds, and what it's going to do, it's going to put a bunch of files into this empty Pixel 1 server folder. And you're going to wait for it to be done. And it's done. You see, it says, successfully downloaded Minecraft server, blah, blah, blah. That's good. That's a good sign. So, next what you want to do is start this right here, this Forge executable fi uh, jar file. You're going to double click that, and give it a second to load, and nothing should happen, except some new folders and stuff should pop up. The first thing you want to do is open up this EULA. This you need to change from false to true. And if you live on the edge like me, you just hit X and then save instead of just hitting Control S. But it doesn't matter which way you do it. Next, you want to go to the modes folder here and drag your Pixel One into the modes folder. Then you simply need to start up, um, start up your server again. And make sure you, you click Forge. By the way, the Minecraft server is going to start up a vanilla server and it will ignore the modes folder, so you're not going to have Pixel One. So, you're going to let it start up again. Uh, you're going to see a lot of stuff. All you got to look for is make sure it says done and spawn loaded. Which we'll see here. It's going to add a bunch of new stuff here. That's perfect. That's what we want. So, see, it's preparing spawn area. And when it's done, it'll say the word that indicates it's done, which is done. But it seems to be taking a while here. I don't know why. Could you hurry up? No, okay. So, while that's going, a thing you could do is go to this server properties file here. This is just the properties for your server, as you could imagine. Well, if you port, if so, you need to port forward to make a server. And if your port is not two five five six five, you're gonna want to change this. Mine is not because I messed it up. So I'm an idiot. All right. So this is now gonna be your port here, and it might it might not be this. It's you get to pick which one you want it to be. But mine is five four three two one. So again, you're gonna live on the edge. Hit X, then save, and that should be done. But by this time, your server should be done doing stuff, which is done. It, this the first time you start it up, it will take longer just because it is loading spawn in the whole world and everything. So once it's done, you can click stop, and you're gonna want to restart it one more time just because it needs to restart for all the stuff to update. So you're gonna click forge again, you let it start up, and while you start it up, you can now start up Minecraft. Uh, when you're in Minecraft, you gotta make sure you want the forge profile with Pixel One installed. If you don't know how to do that, you can go check out the other video on my channel. You're gonna click play, and it's gonna load up Minecraft as you'd expect it to do. Uh, you can check on your server, which again, it should say done when it's done. And, yes, you're gonna... Uh, yes, yeah, see, it's done here. Alright, cool. And it took 2.9 seconds instead of 18 point whatever seconds last time. That's because it's now all loaded. So you're gonna go up here. You're gonna wait a few seconds. And you're gonna hit multiplayer. You then wanna click add server. And then type in your, your IP address followed by that port that you put in the server properties. And you're then gonna click play. And what the result should be is you... On a blue screen, we get to pick your Pokemon starter. We we'll want pick Mudkip, Mudkip, Mudkip Master Race. If this video helped you in any way, make sure you like, subscribe, follow, suck my balls, do any of that sort of thing that makes you feel happy, and I will see you all in the next one. Thank you, and fuck off. How the fuck do I stop this?